Well, the Gourmet and Grapes Culinary Extravaganza is right around the corner. It's happening February the 7th through the 9th at the Sanctuary at Kiowa. And proceeds are going to a very important cause, the Medical University of South Carolina Hollings Cancer Center. Dr. Robert Stewart, along with Brendan Bashford, one of our featured chefs, are here to tell us about this fun-filled event. Uh, and it's not only a fun-filled event, it's probably one of the uh, most spectacular events of food and wine that goes on not only in the low country but pretty much in the southeast if not the entire eastern seaboard tell us about the event for those folks who have never been there and then we'll talk about where the money goes and also how we can get tickets sure well we're very very fortunate in that the event itself chefs want to come to it so we have some of the region's great chefs we have uh, chef fred from the from the fat hen we also have chef mike Mm -hmm. Mike from uh, Latvia, from mm -hmm. um, The Ordinary. Mm -hmm. We also have chefs that come in, so it's a very, very intimate, mm -hmm. and it's just a fun event that we really have a lot of fun at, mm -hmm. and the chefs understand the charity. They want to come in. It's very, very intimate, and they really enjoy inter interacting with all of our mm -hmm. customers out there. It's and a this fun takes event. place outside. Even though the silent auction is inside, a lot of it takes place outside, and even though it's in February, there are these portable heaters and it's just a magnificent evening. It takes place underneath the tent and you have the different chefs that are located all around the grounds, but then, oh my gosh, you bring in some of the most spectacular wines as well. Correct, we have Jordan Winery, we have St. Michelle that come in and we set it up, as you said, in a great big tent. We have some farmhouse tables and it's very, very interactive. Mm -hmm. So the wineries, they're all doing free pours. Everyone comes in, mm -hmm. everyone has a great time. They really enjoy it. And it's very, very casual, mm -hmm. but the food that we serve out there, we give the chefs a lot of free reign and it is a fun event. They might be trying out new dishes for their restaurant. Mm -hmm. They might be educating the people there as well. So it's, it's, it really is something that mm -hmm. we have a hard time saying no to the chefs that want to come mm -hmm. because we, we keep it as intimate and as small as we can. So it does have that vibe mm -hmm. and that feel. Mm -hmm. So. Uh, and doctor, what we're talking about is what takes place just Saturday evening. You've got an event also that's su Saturday, uh, Friday, and then also a brunch on Sunday. So it's an entire weekend that folks in. Then I understand maybe a little specials on the overnight stay at the sanctuary, which you know, huge kudos to Bill Lacey, who's a general manager, does a magnificent job. Uh, tell us about the events that go on on Friday evening. Well, my wife and I have been every year since the inception of this extraordinary event. And the Friday evening is a, a very intimate black tie mm -hmm. dinner that is uh, absolutely the best dinner that you can get in the low country of South Carolina. Mm -hmm. uh, celebrity chefs, our, our own chefs now, you know, are really internationally mm -hmm. known, so we don't have to go very far to get that. Mm -hmm. And uh, you get uh, wine pairings with the uh, vintner actually there to explain all about each wine that you taste during this fabulous dinner. That's Friday night. Mm -hmm. My wife and I get the weekend package, so we actually mm -hmm. stay at the sanctuary for two nights wow. at a much better rate than you can get mm -hmm. <laughs> any mm -hmm. other weekend. Then you it's have the, a fabulous the, the, the weekend. The outdoor event that takes place on Saturday that has a silent auction as well as incredible uh, live auction items that are taking place. And then of course on Sunday, we've got uh, the brunch, the Sunday brunch that takes out uh, out on the Grand Lawn. Yeah. Yes. Well, and what we do for that is we actually have all the chefs from the island. So mm -hmm. you get Chef John from the Atlantic Room. Mm -hmm. You also have Chef Riley from Jasmine Porch, Chef Jason from up in the Ocean Room as well, as well as a lot of the chefs from mm -hmm. all of Kiowa itself. Mm -hmm. And they all do a different dish in the brunch. Mm -hmm. And once again, we keep it very intimate. They're mm -hmm. there on hand. The customers or the, the people that are coming really enjoy the, the mm -hmm. intimacy of the event. Mm -hmm. So they get to learn something. And that's why we have so many people that return mm -hmm. year after year after oh, year. Oh, wow. Wonderful. It, and, and the proceeds go to a wonderful cause that has helped to save thousands of lives here in the Low Country. Medical University of South Carolina, the Hollings Cancer Center. Tell us about that. So the, the Hollings Cancer Center is uh, a National Cancer Institute mm -hmm. designated cancer center, one of less than 70 in the United States, of course the only one in South Carolina. Uh, the designation is important because it recognizes the quality of our research and says that we are international caliber. Unfortunately, it doesn't provide a great deal of money. A mm -hmm. lot of people think the government just showers money mm -hmm. on us, but they don't. Mm -hmm. And community support is absolutely critical especially for our novel ideas and new programs. Mm -hmm. How can folks get a hold of more information on this wonderful extravaganza event that is coming up mm -hmm. in February? 
Well, uh, there's a website mm -hmm. called www.gourmetandgrapes.com. That's the easiest way mm -hmm. uh, to do it. And we also have a telephone number, which I hope is uh, being displayed soon. Uh, it'll be on the website, I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. okay. But uh, check out that. It's coming up February the 7th through the 9th. It's at the Sanctuary at Kiwa. If you've never been to it, it is absolutely fabulous. Uh, some of the, the best food and some of the best wine anywhere in the country, if not the world, will be there that weekend. Gentlemen, thank you so much, and uh, I'm sure we'll see you out there uh, in February. Thank you, thank sir. You. Yes, thank sir. Thank you. More thank coming you. up after the break, so stay with us.